Hey yo, what is up guys, Akarsh here back with another video and yes, you read it right, today we will be transmitting images or videos over 100 kilometers. This is possible using the technique known as LoRa. If you're not familiar with LoRa technique, uh, go check this video out. This is the most popular video of mine with uh, explaining what LoRa is. Basically, in a nutshell, you can transmit data over uh, hundreds of kilometers using small modules like these and... Uh, there's no need of internet or GPS or GPRS for this for transmitting data or satellite communication as well. So LoRa in itself is like magic. Do check that out video from here. So for capturing images and video, we'll be using a camera like this. This is the ESP32 cam, which has a camera over here. I've done a video on this as well. Do check that out from here or the all the relevant links for the video will be in the description box below do check them out but but today we will not be using these modules we'll be using a module from matchx matchx sent me over this uh, pro beautiful product of theirs it has a camera it has a good three inch display uh, antenna for laura and whatnot so if you're interested in doing this or knowing about this product stay tuned to the video <laughs> I have got many PCBs manufactured from PCBWay.com. They are the leading PCB manufacturers from China. They offer 10 PCBs for $5 only. They offer fast turnaround times as fast as 24 hours. Apart from getting PCB manufactured, you can get your PCBs assembled from them for just $30. Do check them out for your PCB related needs. They always have some offer or competition running on their website. Their link will be in the description box below. So the folks over at MatchX checked out my LoRa videos, they were impressed by it and they sent over their brand new product which is the Edge X and this is a very fascinating product as using only this handheld device you will be able to transmit image and video data over LoRa. Yes, uh, we will be not really transmitting images and videos entirely over LoRa because as we all know LoRa has that limited bandwidth but Edge, the folks at MatchX has made this possible kind of possible you may say using ML and AI so what they do is basically extract the data from the images and video which is relevant from images and video and then they transmit that over LoRa this has a variety of applications but before jumping into the applications let's take a closer look at the edgex so the edgex right now is using a 3d printed case which is like very beautiful and robust which was also provided to me by the folks over at matchx but if we look at the decondensed form of the device we have a display which is connected using a display port over here to the main board we also have a sd card slot over here at the bottom we can't access the sd card slot over here because it's fixed inside uh, there are a number of ic's present then we have the usb type c for connecting this to power or and for programming purposes we have a reset button a programmable button then we have a camera over here it is a good quality camera as seen in the esp32 module as well um, apart from that we have some connectors we have a switch uh, over here as well this is the power switch you, it's a physical power switch which i like then over here you have the main module which is their edgex development module the board that you see at the outside is basically a development board but the main hearts of their product is over here that is connected using a pigtail uh, connector over here to the antenna connector sma antenna connector over here we have a microphone here as well other than that we have a, a, a flashlight over here which can be used to indicate different things there are a lot of GPIO pins as well, so you can program the EdgeX to like control many hardware devices according to the signal received on the EdgeX. And there are two to three chips. They claim that they have a neural network accelerator on board in this chip, which basically is very good for AI stuff. And now that we have taken a look at this, let's quickly power this on and let's see what we can do with it. So I have a type C uh adapter over here and as soon as i power it uh the light goes on here and in the and as we can see the camera is on it's like recording the stuff that is present around me uh, so because there is nothing uh, present around me which is like pretty significant but i'll put in pictures over here 
of its object detection so uh, moving on quickly to how this functions and what essentially this does so our edgex device which is from matchx basically consists of these uh, blocks and these are connected to the central data processing unit we may say basically what happens is for the input side we have a camera which is present over here we have a mic which is present over here by using the camera and mic as our input devices we feed in data to the AI ML data processor that is present over here which they call as the neural network accelerator as well this is by by only this setup we are able to do things like audio analysis video analysis and image analysis so all that data from these two sensors you may say goes into the data processor it processes the image video and audio that it receives and it gives a simple lower uh, weight data it gives in simple binary ones and zeros only relevant data so for example you have a car coming in uh, now what we can do is we can using this camera take the picture of that car's number plate recognize its number and only send that data to the uh, through the LoRa module to the other matchx or your gateway so for example you will be able to send the data present in the picture which is the number plate and the number of the car to hundreds and kilometers of distance without even using internet or any paid subscription over LoRa doesn't that sound very amazing now the data flows in like this then the display is an output device so data from the AI ML data processor goes on to the display and the LoRa is a two-way connection either the data can go out from the AI ML data processor to the LoRa and through the antenna to the world for utilize and the other way around as well because this is a transceiver module the LoRa module that we have in the matchx edgex then when the data comes in through the antenna to the LoRa module then the LoRa module can send that data to the data processor this data processor also controls the GPIO pins present over here and which we can display it on the display connected to the edgex as well this is a very fantastic device I have done a couple of projects using this and the response for me is pretty much amazing so there are a lot of applications that you can use in one was as I said car detection then you can detect the numbers other than that you can detect objects using this you can detect people and once you are able to detect people basically you capture their images on the camera you have a pre-trained model set in the data processor once that happens you you have a person coming in hundreds of kilometers apart you using LoRa can know their name if that's processed already in the uh, edgex so the edgex is basically not a very unique device but the combination that is possesses of LoRa the camera the AI technique ML fancy technique that it uses it basically blows my mind off and this is kind of the product that I was using and maybe before I knew about this uh, edgex I was kind of trying to make it using a LoRa and the ESP32 it was a bit challenging because I had to include a Raspberry Pi or uh, or Na Nvidia Jetson Nano because of the AI and ML processing powers that the Jetson Nano has but no this is a much much better option because mm, I just need to program it I don't have to care about the connections because it's already done over there and I just need to plug and play over this so this was my first look at the edgex from matchx do let me know guys if you're interested in uh, taking a look at projects if you want me to build maybe projects using the matchx i can surely do that over video depending on the response and the love from you guys if you want some videos on the edgex drop them down in the comment section below and this is all from my side today thanks for watching Subscribe to our channel if you haven't till now. Also hit the bell icon to stay notified. This is our first signing off.